Okay, so my name is Andres Bosquez, and today I'm going to be giving you guys my informative speech. My informative speech is going to be about music and how it affects our lives every day. So to start you guys off, I'm going to give you a quote by Greek philosopher Plato. The quote is, music is a moral law. It gives souls to the universe, wings to the mind, flight to the imagination, and charm and gaiety to life and everything. I chose this quote because I really do believe that it applies to my presentation. I also do believe in the quote itself. I think that life with music is enhanced and happy, and without it, it could be a bit dull or maybe even boring. So music is everywhere. We go down the street and we hear music playing from different stores. We go and see a movie and we hear 20 different songs in the movie or in the background. So clearly it is everywhere. You just cannot avoid it. It is inevitable. There was a little survey done in Kansas that asked a few different high schools, um, a few different high school students, how often they were listening to music. So a few figures from that, 22.2% of those kids said that they were listening to music one to two hours a day. And from that same survey, 32.2% of those from the 32.2% of those kids also said that they were listening to music around five hours a day. So this means that just half of those kids right there are taking at least an hour out of their own time to listen to music. Now this isn't listening to music where it's implemented already in movies or in school or in stores. This is out of their own time. So obviously it's happening all the time. We're always listening to music. So my main points about this, I believe that music eliminates stress, I believe that it creates happiness, and I believe that it helps you maintain that happiness and maintain that positive mood. I also think that it has a healing power. And for those that play an instrument, it has an even greater healing power. Um, there's been plenty of studies that, uh, that look at Alzheimer's patients and their memory and compares those who don't play an instrument to those who do. And the Alzheimer's patients that do play instruments have better memory recall and have, better, or have an easier time creating uh, mental images. So it is a real thing, and it really does help anxiety also. So my main point is that music is a supplement for life. A supplement, a positive supplement. Um, I believe that it is beneficial, and all forms of it are, are beneficial, whether it's country music, EDM, or jazz, or classical music. It all has its own sort of healing power, and it all plays with the human emotions. So it just kind of depends. It's almost su subjective uh, what kind of music to listen to or what, or what will help you out. So my concluding quote is one by uh, Bono, who is a social activist and also a singer-songwriter. And it is, music can change the world because it can change people. I do believe that music can change the world, and I do believe that it has changed the world already. And whether people see it or not, it always has a huge influence on our everyday lives. Alright, thank you guys.